Hi, everybody. On today's official European League of Football show, we are taking a very close look at our franchise from Stuttgart. Let's see if the search are ready for the second summer. And well, to find out where the franchises are so close to the start of the season, they meet for combined practices. And so did the search together with Ryan Fire. Let's check out what happened on the football field in Duisburg. Yeah, look, tell me what's the vibes, what's the mood? Yeah, I just hit a mic key for the juice. Yeah, ain't no captain, I'ma tell the truth. I've been running for so long, it's hard to lose. Yeah, yeah, be my source, uh, Christian, like the York. Yeah, I can't start when I'm far, I just get back up. Yeah, I've been quiet all along on my TV toes. Yeah, I can't keep it to myself, I just give and go. I'm a visionist, yeah, you can't picture this. Yeah. Sipping essential, that's the essential, I'm influential. Yeah, so fundamental, that's fundamental, on instrumentals. Yeah, speed of the tempo. Yeah, we got potential. Shoot a movie like I'm Denzel. Running my ride to the end zone. And he's sticking to find me. Man, you know where to find me. I'm trying to get me a Grammy so I can dedicate it to my granny. Look, tell me what's the vibes, what's the mood. Yeah, I just hit on my key for the juice. Yeah, ain't no captain, I'ma tell the truth. I've been for so long it's hard to lose okay, yeah, Dio, be my source uh, Christian, like Dior yeah, I can't start when I'm far I just get back up yeah, I've been quiet all along On my TV toes yeah, I can't keep it to myself I just give and go Look, tell me what's the vibes What's the moves Tell me what's the vibes What's the moves Yo, bring it in all together Let's yeah. 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 Have fun in it on three Let's go! Three, one, two, three! Family! Yeah! yeah. Well, that looked promising. And uh, I'm welcoming my guest now, who is new on the Stuttgart Search roster, wide receiver, right, wide receiver Noah Bomba, who played for the Frankfurt Galaxy in Season 1. Hi, Noah. Hi, Janice. Thanks for having me here. Thank you very much for being on the show today. Let's find out where and how the Stuttgart search are. But first of all, I want to know from you, new season, new franchise. How do you feel about summer 2022? I'm ready. I'm, I can't wait for the season. It's one and a half weeks to go and I'm, I'm more than ready. I'm hyped. Exactly. We are all hyped, especially the short video now from the combined practice was just making me so excited. I can't wait for the season to start. And when looking at that footage, we just saw what went on with Ryan Fire there. What can you tell us about it? How was it? It was a great combine practice. We just uh, drove to Düsseldorf, had, had uh, two days camp out there. On Saturday, we had a combine practice, uh, which was really, really good. We just saw new faces, saw new defense, and it was great just play against each other, having a one-on-ones with new players, having seven-on-seven, seven, having a full scrimmage with referees out there was great. And for those of you who might not know what a combined practice is, could you explain it to us a little bit better? Yeah, for sure. Like the name is a combined practice, so we just went to the Düsseldorf and had a combined practice with another franchise. Um, where like we with the Stuttgart search and the Ryan Fire um, just met each other and just have a practice with each other and yeah that's a common practice having one on ones with each other having team practice with each other and yeah that's a combined practice. <laughs> and you're one of the few franchises who met with the Ryan Fire for the first time because they are new to the league and they have a very experienced head coach for example with Jim Tom Sula. Everybody's, or a lot of people say that they are going to be very strong from the beginning. Would you agree? What was it like to, to see them for the first time? It was great. They have a good coaching staff. I mean, a few players were injured, but I think they're going to be very strong for the first season. And um, they have a great coaching staff, though. They're going to be coached very, very good. So, and that's what football is about, getting coached and bring it all out on the field. That's true. And what about the Serbs then? Because, I mean, the franchise had quite of a tricky season in year one, but a lot of things have changed. You are new on the roster and so is your quarterback, for example, Randall Schröder. 
And he recently said in an interview on the European League of Football website that the Serge are so ready and so willing to win. Would you agree? Yeah, I agree totally with that. So every practice I can see the fire in each other's eyes and we look at each other as a whole family and we just read and we just want to want to bring it all out on the field. So what would you say is going to be the key to your success this upcoming summer? Just because we are family and it's just we want to win for each other. You can see this in every practice. We celebrate when the defense make a play. We celebrate when the offense make a play. We're just celebrating and making party on the field. So that's, that's so cool for real. And now you are new on the search roster. How, how did the bonding go so far? Uh, it, it, it was good. So it's of course it's new team new year but it's it's football so it's the same same shit every time it's, it's just an, uh, just a few new faces but i'm not a head coach good and it just it's just football you know well it's football that's what we all love and that's what we all can't wait to see who would you say are the players to keep an eye on from the stuttgart search i would say randy schroeder for real He's a good quarterback. I saw that uh, in the scrimmage. He just he just calm in the pocket, throw it balls. Also can run, what I didn't expect it to be honest. <laughs> um, we have a good running back score. We have Chris Wamba, Sanka, Brian Yangson. So we have a lot of good running backs and our defense. Our defense is so good this year. Yeah, we we put on a we put on the squad a few guys of the galaxy. We put on, on some new faces who haven't played in the league before, but the defense is pretty stacked. Exactly, <laughs> some of the galaxy players came and changed uh, and went to the Stuttgart search. Also, same question to you now: Why did you guys make this transfer? Because you won the the championship with the Frankfurt Galaxy last year. How did the search convince you to do this transfer? So, for me personally. I'm not a head coach since I was 15 uh, from the Stuttgart search and Coach Hanselman. He just taught me all of all everything I know in football and in the weightlifting room. He was like, like a father figure to me. And I, I'm after the season, after the ball game, I just talked to Coach K, the head coach of Galaxy, and he was he would, he, he told me like, yo, we have a pretty stacked receiver core, and I know you weren't happy with your playing time last season. And just be open for, for the offers, just talk to other coaches and yeah, I talked to a few franchises and yeah, the best offer from the search. Uh, I went there for a, a recruiting visit. They all were so handsome to me. They loved me from day one, um, showed me the facilities, showed me the stadium, everything. And it just felt right, you know, it just felt good out there. <laughs> And what's your goal for the upcoming season? My goal, Jenny, I'm playing football to win, so my goal is the championship. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody and would you say that uh, sorry, yeah, continue. Yeah, everybody is saying nah the surgeons got a uh, got a pretty tough group and they were they won't be going to the championship team, but I'll be honest to you, I just wanna win and that's why I play football, I wanna win a championship and get another ring on my finger. Well, yeah, but as you said, it's going to be a long way because you are well part of a very strong conference together with the Vienna Vikings, Tyrol Raiders, and your former team, the Frankfurt Galaxy. We will go through your season, a regular season schedule in a bit. But what I would like to know from you as well, would you say that, or do you feel that you have better chances to show your talent and skill together with the search this season? If you want to be the best, you got to beat the best. And like I said, in this division, it's great to show my potential. It's I can let it all out on the field, and I'm sure I'm, I'm getting my my plays, and I'm sure I'm I'm gonna show this league what I got. I just worked my ass off in the off season, you know, and now it's the time. Oh yes, now is the time. And then on top of that, when looking at the Stuttgart search, well, there is Jakob Johnson the NFL fullback from the Las Vegas Raiders, and he's the new co-owner of the franchise. And he came to visit you during the NFL off-season. What was it like to meet, such an, to meet such an experienced football player? It was cool. So he, he came out to the combine, and, and he, he was just a cool guy. He was motivating everybody. He was screaming at everybody and just 
just be be a football player. You know, he, he wasn't like a co-owner. He was a football player on the field. It was pretty cool because I have a funny story. When I when I was at the bench press, I was mad because I didn't bench ten reps. I just benched eight, and he was screaming at me like, "Hey, yo, you're stronger than most of the college players. So be proud of you. Be proud of you." And I'd be like, "Oh, thanks, <laughs> thank you." Well, that, that's a nice compliment. What, yeah. what, other, what advices did he give you, for example? He just he he just he just a motivator. To be honest, he just do everything to keep us motivated. He just he didn't give us a lot of advices. He just be like, "Yo, be yourself." Play football. I know you can do this, and I know you can be, uh, you can be one of the top teams in this league, and just, just be you. And it was, I think, one of the best advice, advices, if you see it like that. Yeah. And do you know, or how, how would he, um, how is he going to support you during the season now? I don't know yet. I, I think, I think he's coming up. Last year he went to, I think, one or two games. I hope I will see him again. In, in the Galaxy Stadium this year, because he's for real, he's a cool guy and he's a motivator. So I, when I was at the Jacob Johnson camp, and he was he was also there because it was his camp, and um, he also for the kids, he just it 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 rained and he was like, yo, that's a God's gift, so just enjoy it, just enjoy playing football, and he just enjoy every moment he's on the field with it. everybody. He don't care if it's NFL, if it's you, if it's the Stuttgart search, he's just enjoy the moment. Yeah. yeah, and all of us enjoy the sport. And now let's come, let, let's come back to the search when facing the franchise this summer. What do the other teams need to be aware of? What would you say? What's going to be your strength? I think our strengths are, are fire in our, our eyes. We just want to prove the league wrong because everybody's mm -hmm. like, oh, the search is going to be weak, the search is going to be this and this. And I saw what we got. And to be honest, I didn't expect it to be that strong. I didn't expect it by myself. So I think it's just we are whole family. So we fight for each other. And like I said, you can see the fire in the eyes. Everybody's hype and everybody want to make a play for each other. And I think because we play for each other, that's going to be, a, that's going to be our strength. It doesn't matter if it's offense, defense, kicking teams. I don't care if everybody plays for each other with heart. Well, I'm pretty sure that the Stuttgart Surf fans are very happy to hear that. Now let's take a closer look at your regular season schedule. You have 12 games coming up and, as we mentioned before, a very tough conference. Um, everything starts with week one, of course. You will be playing against the Barcelona Dragons at home. So soon, very soon, you will be seeing the players face to face. Um, and to get ready for this, I have another guest joining us right now, Barcelona Dragons cornerback Jordi Brugnani. So oh. let's get the on and off the field battle started here. Hi, Jordi. Hello, hello, hello. Hey, what's welcome. up, my brother? <laughs> welcome to the hello. show. Thank you very much for joining us. And Jordi, as I said, it June the 5th is coming closer. What do you look forward to the most? We're just looking forward to start. Like it's been it's been long since we ended up this season. Uh, everybody got ready. Everybody's getting ready, and then we just want to play. You know, it's it's over. I'm trying to like uh, practice against each other. We just want to play against somebody else. So, how ready are the Barcelona Dragons? Tell us something about your preparations. I mean, uh, this year we got like a. Um, some NFL coaches, so they install some NFL type of practice and playbook and everything. So we just ready. We just want to prove everybody wrong as well. You know, like like uh, Bomba said, we the underdogs. So we just got to show everybody that we can still play. Yeah. Well, I did have your head coach as a guest in one of the shows. Uh, he is very supportive and very enthusiastic, and it was a great pleasure talking to him. What what can you tell us about the Barcelona Dragons defense? What's going to be your strength? I mean, the whole defense. We just uh, a bunch of people that we just want to play our hardest all the time. So we just want to make plays. We just it's everybody. I cannot say D line or like linebackers or defensive backs because it's everybody. We just want family on defense. We'd like to celebrate. We'd like to have fun. 
uh, we got a new coach uh, comes from Mexico and he's like, uh, he feels the same vibe as we do. So that helps a lot when you got a coach that is always the same vibe that we have. So I think we're pretty strong and then we're going to show up on week one. Well, you, you better do because you have to face Noah, which brings us to a little battle here right now. Jordy, well, the Dragons cornerback is going to face the search wide receiver. How deep will you look him in the eyes? Hey, it's going to be a battle every snap. <laughs> every snap, brother. <laughs> every snap. I hope you worked or not in the offseason, bro. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the thing, Jordi. Uh, how, how carefully did you watch film of Noah? Did you figure out a way to stop him? We got to stop everybody. So it's not only him. So I think they got like weapons everywhere. They got a good quarterback. So we got to we gotta stop the whole team. It's not only about him. So we, we're getting ready. We're getting ready. We got to still a uh, whole week to get ready for them. So we're going to be ready when we get this to Stuttgart. Hey, I can't wait, bro. I can't wait. Wait, can't wait. Noah, how well do you know Jordi? I know you played against each other last season when you were still with Frank, uh, Frankfurt. How can you get past him? Just play football. Just be smart. Just be smart and play, play my game. That's all. <laughs> I mean, we got weapons in the offense. So like Jordi said, it's not about me. It's about the whole offense. And we all do our jobs. It's gonna be a tough matchup, I'm, but I'm sure we're gonna fight through this. And yeah, the better one will win at the end of the day. <laughs> well, and Jordi, coming back to you now quickly, because speaking about defense and offense, you lost one defensive player to the offense, uh, Nico Lester, who is going to be the running back this season. Will he be missed on your side? I mean, he's he's gonna be missed, but we got a good replacement, so. It's not, it's not like we lose a player because he's still on the team. So he can still play both sides. So if we need him, we can, he can always come back. But I guess we need him more at offense too because he's like a, like, a, like a Swiss, you know, like. Swiss so, nice. we <laughs> exactly. so we can use him everywhere and, and be productive everywhere. So he's going to be productive in offense as well. So he's good for us as well. He well, played offense last year, didn't he? He played a little bit of offense. Yeah. So this year is less is more focused on offense, but he can still play defense whenever we need him. So he's a dog. So yeah. he can do it all. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> well, it's always good to have such a weapon on the on the roster. Uh, so week one is gonna be a game at home in Stuttgart. Noah, is there anything you want to say to your fans? Because I know that the search fans are very supportive. Yeah, and hey, come to the stadium, get your popcorn ready because it's a whole new group and I can't wait to meet you all at the 5th. Just come to the stadium, come at the Gazi Stadium and I'm hyped. I'm hyped to show what we perform, what we practice in the off-season and just enjoy the moment, enjoy the time you, you, you can do it in the stadium and be ready, be ready for some big time plays. <laughs> <laughs> well, Jordi, what do you want to say to the Barcelona Dragons fans now? Will they have a party or can they celebrate on June the 5th in the evening? They always party. It don't matter if we win or not. So they always ready for us, you know. So their support is always good. They're, like without them, I think we we wouldn't be that because they get the extra power that we need sometimes. So they always ready, even if we so. We, we just expect them to party even if we lose. I hope we can win. I'm not going to say we're going to win because obviously you, you still got to play a game. But, but yeah, I'm, I'm ready for them. They ready for us. So they've been yes. ready the whole, the whole year. So they stay ready. <laughs> More ready than ever before, I would say. Now, well, yeah. week two, Rod's left Panthers. Um, I think that's going to be another tough game for the, for the search. Noah. Yeah, it's going to be a tough matchup. Um, but it's good. We play at home, so the fans can see in week one what we got and come back in week two. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually very true. So uh, go and get your tickets, of course. Come come to the stadiums, all of you. Of course, not only the Search fans, the Barcelona Dragons fans as well. 
And um, week three is going to be your first game away in Austria. How much are you looking forward to that matchup? Yeah, I'm so excited for this because um, two players have played in the U17 All-State Bavarian team playing for the Vienna Vikings now and I can't wait to play, play in such a big stadium and see them again and it's going to be great for you and to yeah. see the beautiful yeah. as well. <laughs> Absolutely and then in week four it's the other Austrian team but coming to Stuttgart this time how, how difficult is it going to be to play against any of the two Austrian teams this year? Yeah, I'm just excited. I don't know what we got to expect, so we will see it in the first weeks, then watch some tape, and I'm just excited to meet new new opponents who are coming up to Stuttgart or we coming going down to to, uh, to Austria, and I just can't wait to meet them all on the field. What I hear, they got a good squad, so I'm just excited to play against the best players on the on in Europe. Yeah, well, that, that's what well, that's what we all want to see, and that's what we want you to do. Coming to week five, Leipzig Kings. I think they are going to be very tough this season as well. Like like each and every team, the, the, the level of play has just gone up so much, or it seems to have. Yeah, they all got new players and I haven't played Leipzig before, so I'm excited and looking forward to this. Um, yeah, it's going to be tough, but every team got new strengths, every, every team lost some players, so it's it's a whole new season and I'm just excited to see what all teams got this year. And then in week five, your former franchise is coming to Stuttgart, Frankfurt Galaxy. How special is that game going to be for you? Oh, it's going to be a special game for real. I'm just excited and it's one of my... I'm looking forward to this day for real. I just want to prove them what I got on the field, show them what I learned from the Galaxy last year. I mean, I played with the best receivers out in Europe. I mean, we had Anthony Mahongo out there on the wideout. We had Lawrence Regler. We had Henrik Schwartz. And we have in slot also Nico Straman, Marvin Rooch, Jay Cousau. And I learned a lot. And I'm just looking forward to this day and meet my old teammates again, meet my old coaches. And yeah, just let it out. <laughs> well, yeah, the Frankfurt Galaxy are definitely looking strong again. Jordi. Do you think they, they have good chances to make it to the championship game again? I mean, they they the champions, so we got to respect that at the end of the day. I think everybody in this league can make it because if you get to the playoffs, playoffs is just one game. So anything can happen in playoffs. So the first step is getting to the playoff, and then we'll see from there for everybody. Well, yeah, that's that's true. And what about you, Noah? How far can the Galaxy go this year? We will see. I think it's a tough division, so um, yeah. they got a pretty good squad. A uh, pretty good squad. Um, they lost some faces, but they also their linebacker core. They have some new all stars in their linebacker core, so I think they're gonna be strong. And um, I think. We will see it at the, at the end of the season. Who's gonna be first? Who's gonna be first in, in the conference? And then, like Jordi said, playoffs is a whole different vibe. Different is just one game, and it's do or die. Yeah, Jordi, who do you think is going to be your toughest opponent this year? Say again. Ah, who do you think is going to be your toughest opponent this upcoming season? I was I would say I played against Vienna uh Vienna in the Spanish league for the like the European championship and then I think Vienna is, is already tough like everybody in this league is tough so we don't know how ready the the Stuttgart is we don't know how ready everybody is because obviously they get new additions so and we still got to see tape so first of all it's going to be Stuttgart the toughest one because it's the opening, so they want to show out to their to their stadium that they ready, that they not underdogs, and then we just gotta show out as well, you know. First of all, it's Stuttgart, so we're going for them. Let's well, and go. then week twelve, you guys meet again, payback time. But this time, <laughs> the search will be coming to Barcelona. Noah, are you looking forward to that trip? 
Oh, I'm, hey, I'm looking forward to this trip. They have great fans out there, and I just can't wait to meet again. Flying to Barcelona is always a great trip, and they have a cooler stadium, they have good fans, and yeah, I just can't wait for this payback chance. <laughs> 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 well, and Jordi, you want to make sure that your fans at home are going to have an even bigger party to celebrate, I'm sure. Yes, yes, go and get your tickets. <laughs> <laughs> do, you, do you have any last words for Noah now? <laughs> Before seeing him again on June the 5th? I'll say they got a week to get ready, so stay ready because we're coming. Yes, sir, I'm ready. <laughs> I'm ready. Oh, yeah, I'm ready too. Exactly, Noah. How, how are you going to scare Jordi now? <laughs> <laughs> I don't need to scare him. It's just, it's just a football match. We are, we are family, and at the end of the day, the better one will win. You know. Exactly. <laughs> Well, but still, both of you want to win, and well, I sound like a broken record. We can't wait. We are everybody is so excited to watch the very first game on June the fourth. Thank you guys for being on the show today. Thank you very much. Thank you for having thank us. Thank you for having us. Thank you. And to you at home, well, thank you very much for watching. And uh, as we just said, come to the games, watch the games online on the European League of Football website. If you cannot make it to the stadiums, go and get your game pass. Well, and then the football party can start. Thank you and very much for watching on, and see you very soon. And get your tickets on Ticketmaster. <laughs> <laughs> yes, <laughs> come to the games. <laughs> <laughs>